Coach, congratulations on an opening round win here in the NCAA tournament. Can you give us your initial thoughts on uh, today's match against Trinity? Uh, th first of all, thank you very much. Um, initial thoughts are that I, I think that my team executed the game plan we went in with. Uh, I think they stuck to it. They were pretty disciplined. Uh, I thought we served tough, and I think that was a huge factor in this match. Uh, as well as, I thought we stayed in system for most of the match with our passing. Wonderful, and, and you certainly got a terrific performance out of Amelia to your left here. She had a wonderful day today swinging at the ball. Can you talk to us a little bit? I mean, you guys come out as a team. You were ready to go today. Yeah, we were all really fired up and ready to go. I mean, first round, we wanted to make a statement, and I think we did that, so that was great for us. Well, you had Amelia off the front of the net, and Brittany, you guys had a, a strong day in, in the backside, uh, making sure that you were setting up your teammates, giving them a chance this to This one over here. <laughs> I've ever out that center, the ball's going to her because I trust her with it. I know she's going to put it to the floor and put it in a good spot. Well, knowing that you guys uh, got to turn around in uh, tomorrow's match, uh, depending on you get to see the winner of either Emory or Salem, you guys going to stick around and watch the next match as well? For do a little sure, scouting? Definitely. Yeah, we will. So, and you guys have played Emory this year already, correct? Yeah. Yes, we have. So <laughs> what, are your, what are your thoughts on uh, what, having seen them earlier this year? It's going to be a fun match, I think. Yeah, I'm pumped for it. It's going to be yeah. very competitive. Good. Wonderful. Well, congratulations. Thank you guys for being here, and we'll look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Thank, right. you. Thank, Thank you. you. Um, certainly, I'm sure not the way that you all wanted today to go, but um, Coach, would you mind giving us your thoughts on initial thoughts on today's game, at least? Yeah, I mean, I just think, unfortunately, with Trinity not having been in the NCAA tournament the last three years, I... I think it had a bigger impact than we anticipated. Um, we didn't really play with a lot of nervousness at the beginning of the match. I think Juniana did too, but uh, we were never able to move beyond it. Um, and we were uncharacteristically uh, higher error than we've been, whether it was reception errors, service errors, hitting errors. and. Um, and it wasn't for a lack of effort for trying, but I think it, um, it had a lot to do with not being on the stage um, for a number of years. Meredith is the only one that's been in the NCAA tournament as a freshman, and um, it's, it's, uh, it leaves a bad taste in your mouth for everybody because this is not uh, our volleyball team. We are not playing. Uh, we did not show the ability that we had on this team. In that match. Aaron, you guys... Uh you know, certainly never really able to get yourselves kind of in rhythm today. I mean, as uh, somebody who gets to come back and, and lead this team again next year, I mean, what are your thoughts trying to channel today's experience and help you guys grow and get better? I think today just kind of gives us a fire, um, certainly for spring season and definitely for next season, just because for so many of us, I mean, like y'all said, Mary's the only one who's been here before, and so many of us were just nervous and excited, and we just had so much energy, and we just couldn't quite get it together, you know. And I think definitely next year, now that we've been here and we've seen, you know, the possibilities and how good that we can be if we really work together, I think next year we're just going to come back with so much fire and so much passion to get back, back here again next year. Oh, Meredith, how good can they be? You've been playing oh. with them now. <laughs> I am just so proud of them. I, I keep telling them I've never been on a team with this much talent. And even in my, my freshman year when we went to the Elite Eight, you know, it was a few key players that really got us there. And I'm just so proud of their work ethic. And we've really changed the culture of our team to be one that's more dedicated and focused, you know, on the team goals and putting our, you know, our own, I guess, goals below that of the team. And so I know that they're going to do incredible things in the next few years because, uh, and I'm excited. I'm excited to watch and see how they do.